Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. To anyone who's new here, welcome. My name is Kelsey. I post motivational videos every single Sunday on things related to cleaning, decorating, organizing, that kind of stuff. So if that's something that interests you, be sure to subscribe so you don't miss a video. But moving on to today's video. So for anyone who's followed me and watched my previous videos, you know that I've been talking about doing a nursery makeover for a while and I'm excited to say that it is finally here. I did it and that is what today's video is going to be. I'm going to show you guys the process that I went through on doing this extreme nursery makeover and then I'm also going to show you at the end just a little tour of how everything turned out. To start out with everything, I just pushed all of the furniture to the middle of the room and then I just started painting. I decided to do the same color pink as in my other daughter's room just because we had a bunch of paint left over from when we painted her room and I really loved that color pink anyways. But yeah, so I am just starting out painting everything. And also in case you're wondering, my husband is just patching over some holes that were there from some shelves that we had previously in the room. I also feel like I need to say that I am no expert in painting. In fact, I'm absolutely terrible, so please don't judge. We ended up doing two coats on the walls, but this is the room fully painted. Next, I'm just moving all of the furniture back to where it's supposed to go, and then I'm going to start tidying everything up so that I can move on to decorating.
Also, I know I look ridiculous trying to fit all of these pillows into one tote. It probably would have been a lot easier if I would have just found another tote and put them in different totes, but I just decided to try to shove them all into one tote. So here we are. I'm just taking these storage cubes. I got them at Walmart. I believe they were only $4. That's where I've gotten them for all of my kids' rooms. But I'm just taking them and putting them together and putting them into the shelf. I hung the curtains where the previous curtains were and you'll see later in the video I ended up having my husband move the curtains a little bit higher. I like to have them high and a little bit out from the window if that makes sense. I just like to be able to see the whole window and I feel like it makes the room feel a little bit bigger. I got most of her decorations for her room at Hobby Lobby, but these flowers I got off of Amazon for $10, and I didn't really know if they would be that great, but honestly, they are awesome. I'm so happy with how they turned out, and they were super easy. I even had to peel a couple of them off and restick them, and they didn't take up any paint or anything, so if you're looking for some flowers for a room, I definitely recommend these. And I can have them linked in the description box down below too if you're interested.
this is the finished product the only thing that i can say is that there is some white speckles on the flowers but honestly i thought that they weren't even noticeable um i don't even know if you can see them <laughs> from the videos but i feel like they turned out so pretty Her curtains were really wrinkly out of the package and I had a little bit of time so I just decided to steam them and I didn't take a whole ton of time on them. I could have taken a lot longer but I was kind of over it and just wanted to get most of the wrinkles out. And keeping it real over here, Sayla ended up getting really fussy and I just wanted to quick vacuum her room so I just ended up holding her to get it done. And honestly this is what most of my days look like anyways. If I'm trying to get something done usually she wants to be held and I am multitasking. I'm holding her and doing whatever I'm trying to do. But that is it for today. This is the finished nursery makeover. If you guys enjoyed today's video, give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more organizing, cleaning, and decorating videos, be sure to subscribe. But I will see you guys next week with another motivational video.